The first area where we can see battery charging capacity is inside of endpoint troubleshooting. Going into devices, filtering on laptops, and then choosing a laptop. This is the device pillar, and here under the hardware properties we can see the battery charging health. If instead you wanted to see a collection of systems battery health, we'll stay inside of endpoint troubleshooting, but we'll use an instruction. Using the super bar, we'll search for battery and find the instruction that calls out battery health. Now, we don't want desktop, so we're going to filter coverage on hardware and specifically look for laptops. Now we'll run the instruction against our fleet. Here are our three laptops, and here's their battery charging capacity. For the last demonstration, we're going to go to endpoint automation. The device health policy is pulled up, but when looking at the rules, you can see there is one for battery health. Clicking on it, we can see which devices are in compliant and out of compliancy. And when they are out of compliant, you can view the history to see when and how often it's checked in to say it's failed the battery health compliancy. If 80% charge capacity is not acceptable for your environment, you can search for that rule and then edit the rule going down to the check section and editing the capacity for your needs.